Hi, and welcome to Let's Win XCOM Long War. I'm Philip, and I'll be hosting. Our casualty rate has climbed. Our troop shortage is becoming a problem. We should start screening potential candidates at the barracks immediately. Uh huh. Uh huh. Oh, yes, yeah, so I had to go on a terror mission. And I went on that crash mission instead of this abduction. And there's no way I'm going on this abduction when satellite uplink facilities at maximum capacity additional uplink required where is it yes argentina let's face it argentina can take the hit satellite uplink facilities at maximum capacity additional uplink required 381 i'm going to hire some more soldiers cuz i'd love to have Some better recruits. All right, interrogate Muton complete. Plasma weaponry research credit earned. Mm-hmm. 23 days to plasma carbines. How many chrysalid corpses do I have? 12. The chrysalid autopsy Mm, and the cyber disc all right I'm gonna check the hold on one second I'm gonna check the tech tree to see what I get cyber disc autopsy <clears throat> allows the defense matrix which causes two attacks to miss your interceptors as well as the auto sentry turret not sure exactly what that does for the shiv the chrysalid autopsy allows chitin plating which is 3 health and 50% melee damage the muton interrogation is done I can research ammo conservation at the foundry thin men could help with UFO tech uh-huh psionics all tech beam Let us just jump right into plasma carb carbines, I think. That'll take 23 days, but once that's done, oh my goodness, that'll be amazing. I mean... It is kind of tempting to just finish up the autopsies. Eight. Fourteen days. I don't actually need to interrogate that, so it's actually eleven days. No. We're going straight for it. Because who knows when the next nasty wave of alien troops is going to arrive. All right. Two interceptors, four hours for avalanche missiles. Are my barracks looking? Pretty good. Oh, how's my hangar? 
Okay, good. Couple hours. Let's just tap this one. We have too many damage interceptors to risk actually taking it. Disengaging. It's a hunter. Okay, I need one floater captive and I'll receive three engineers from Canada. I will happily comply. Okay, let's look at our hangar now. Couple hours on all of them. Perfect. Okay, this one we will will risk taking down. Enemy is padlocked. We'll go with an aiming boost. Lost the bubble. We will transfer one here. And we'll send this out for the win. We have eyes on the <coughs> Nearing strike range. Come on. Ah. Too slow on the tracking boost. What a waste. Thankfully, we transferred this. Bangs out. No joy here. Plenty of troops, loads of troops. And we have newbies. Let's see where the. Oh. Okay, everything's happening all at once. <clears throat> All right. <clears throat> okay, we want to establish a quad of satellite uplinks as quickly as possible. When these two are done, we can start wiping these two out and putting power generators up here. And then we can start building down here again. Now we already tapped this one. Council reports coming. Commander, we have multiple reports of new abductions in progress. The locations are marked on the hollow globe. Definitely don't want to lose Germany. Oh my goodness, we have so many troops. Alright, let's look at our rookies first. Even though it's a swarming mission, our new technology really makes it plausible. Perfect aim. Um, above average willpower, low move. So aim, will. Um, above average willpower, but only by one. Not impressed. Perfect aim, terrible everything else. It's okay. Near perfect aim, slightly better willpower than the last, but still lame. Um, below average everything. Mm, right on average aim, basically below average. This guy is average in every way. Hmm. That is shit, man. We can't get any good rookies to save our lives. And at this point in the game, I'm just not going to bother with okay rookies. Okay. Do this. 
We have far too many choices. <sighs> okay. Swarming abduction. Abduction always screams rockets to me. How many rocketeers do I have? One wounded and one not. Okay, this is why we have no gunners. Although this guy only has willpower to suit him. Make him better as a gunner. Let's customize this guy's last name. This guy is going to be a rifleman. Suppression or lock and load? Suppression is key due to my lack of... Oh, damn. Okay. We really want to push someone into the next tier uh, for officer upgrades. Got two captain vanguards. Sniper, Rifleman, Rocketeer. Take a Brute, let's look at this build. <clears throat> Bullet Swarm, Extra Conditioning, Tactical Sense. This should be Mayhem, which should add 2 damage. But I'm not sure that it does. As a matter of fact, I'm going to save and see if it actually does what I think it should. Oh god, I've exited this twice. Oh, I don't like that at all. Can't tell. Maybe it's bugged. My apologies. Okay, so this is going to be tough. Let's go in guns blazing. We should have a while to recover after this. We'll take both these assault. We'll take a lesser infantry rifleman. I want the medic, the rocketeer. A scout. A rookie. Let's leave one of these guys. Take another rookie. Oh, I should take a shiv. And a rookie.
Just in case there's anything robotic. Swarm says rifleman, he's got below average everything. Definitely want some suppression. Laser sight, yeah. Okay, who's not wearing decent armor? these guys to survive. Three smoke grenades. Don't know how difficult this is going to be. Site is near the German border. Mm. These places are decent for assaults, so. This is Big Sky. Strike team has reached the AO. Requesting authorization to deploy. Solid copy, Big Sky. Looks like Strike two cyber discs. This one has snapshot. Okay. Raise your hand if you really don't like this. I'm going to start off by hoping we don't trigger any other pods after this. And that these guys stay together move to where I can rock at them. So just the one moved up? I don't like that. Guess I can deal with that, however. Closed up.
I don't know exactly what to do. Let's this out and see how it looks. Okay. Caught the shiv. Caught the soldier. Doesn't do too much damage to our poor Shiv. I guess this is as good a first kill as any if it actually dies. Which realistically it may not. Please don't trigger any enemies. Damage reduction can't reduce below one. Two damage is about what I'd expect. Ugh, come on. Sealed. This guy concealed back here. Also, he'll function as bait. Guy has the most health. And we want to be able to snapshot them later. Please, this one cyber disc is. Okay, just. Oh, oh no, grenade. Alright, great, great. I can handle that. Unless that car explodes, in which case, I, I don't know what to do, really. Yeah, drones, you suck. Glad I brought the shiv. Things are moving, things are moving. Mutons. Okay, obviously this is on fire, which is bad. Can't move through there. Don't want to stand next to the car. That grenade did as little... That was just amazing how little damage it did. This should be a really impressive hit. Wow, that was a really unimpressive hit. Um, we'll be using a shredder rocket once we move our assault. Backwards or forwards? 
Let's go for the shot and move back. We'll use our running gun. Wait, we may put him on overwatch. All right. This is so gonna work. We're all gonna be really impressed with how accurate my rockets are. Okay, that's fine. Because we have an infantry with a shotgun, plus the hollow targeting, 98% chance to hit, two shotgun shots. <coughs> okay. So this rookie got a kill. This one could use a kill. Wow. Okay. Well, let's not waste shotgun shot. Okay, that thing is going to explode. We're not going to toy around with that. This last drone will probably run, or would, if it could. Mm, I suppose I should have gone... Yeah, let's go ahead and go for that. Okay, smoldering ruin, but only four damage taken in total against two cyber discs. I unless this van explodes, for God's sake, it is on fire. Tell me the van doesn't explode. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, some guys busted through these doors. So. So that's a thing. And there are probably still mutons in there. All right, I'm not feeling all these people holding out pistols. Let's position ourselves. We don't have to reload quite yet. Do want shotgun overwatches that won't all trigger on the same person, I think. We're gonna pull in so we can't see down this lane. Reload. Because you know I don't like Shiv Overwatch. Um hmm. This rookie still hasn't got a kill. The sniper we will position just so. Concentrate rookie overwatch. 
Got our rockets over here in case we need to fire down this right hand corridor. Move our medic up. We're not gonna heal just yet. <laughs> a lot of explosives went off, so there's probably a lot of wandering aliens. My understanding of the sound system, and I've talked to Aminari about this, who is one of the deepest code delvers in all the XCOM community. Uh huh. No verbal warning. So my understanding of how sounds like breaking glass and explosions and stuff affect the game is that it causes enemies to patrol that otherwise wouldn't. So oh, there is no cover there. Making it super sketchy. Um and possibly head in your direction, although it's not totally clear exactly what happens to anyone. So, in general, making noise makes encountering aliens much more likely. Okay, we heard the door bust open. Wasn't the side door. Could be the back doors. I'm gonna reload my shotguns. We have Almost too much overwatch going on. But I suppose you can never have too much overwatch. I reloaded because if I'm fighting multiple pods in a row, I really don't want to have to reload my shotguns. And one guy was down to like two or three shots left. Okay, this looks pretty empty. This Ricky can move up and open this door. Maybe it tells aliens to move towards you, like setting a patrol route on your location. Maybe not. Can't remember if grapple ends your turn. Counts as one move. So if there are enemies above us, That could kind of suck. Okay, the terrain in that building will actually keep those aliens busy. You hear that? 
Looks like they're gonna come out the front. Do I really wanna push forward to make that hard on them? Get ready for a snapshot rocket out there. We're just gonna go ahead and pop a smoke. Get here so we can see some of the movement. Move this shiv up here. Oh, that's not good. Okay. This is a bit much. Should be concealed. Okay, what's that? Six mutons. This is an action we just really don't want to fight. So... We're gonna pull back and draw them into Overwatch. That's dashing, huh? Let's just Do we even want to know? Let's move this up here. Hmm. You know, it's probably as good a chance as they're going to get.
awfully close to my units, you say. True that. Still. Oh, please, rocket gods. <sighs> I figured he could absorb the hit if he had to. Chains to crit, super high. Suppression Ranger, okay, that's a... Wow, that was beneficial. You got this. That is not good. It's, empty. it's okay. No one, no one's really surprised. All right, we get two shots. Come on, crit. And again. Shame. Huh? Sniper's not doing any good up here. Oh, we want to capture a live floater, I forgot. Let's scare the crap out of this guy. Let's just wipe the mutons, we can worry about the floaters later. Okay, no blood, no whatever their siren call is. Two health. These two, huh? I do not know how I'm gonna deal two damage. Maybe we can catch him in Overwatch. Retreat. Good. Yes, yes, yes. Perfect. Perfect. It was a pretty serious attack. Uh, grenade? I would have preferred a grenade, but hey. This guy will probably finish off our poor shiv. Happens. Yeah, yeah, you're a big shot. So many mutons. Okay, we've got one Overwatch. Guess we moved back prematurely. That was all of our rockets. grenade left. This 
So let's just fight a running retreat at this point. This guy is not going to get an overwatch shot <clears throat> and to a defensible position. So we'll just run him back. This should be a perfect spot for our sniper. Okay, remember. <coughs> Where I want to throw my grenade. Grenade out. We just want to break their morale, <coughs> wear them down as much as possible. Not want to tempt them into throwing grenades, however. Moving to firing position. I feel. what he decides to do, just take a shot, good. Sort of upset we can't see that guy. Take our shot as we move back. Or that is not good. Use some ammo over here. Should I take two shots? No. He has lots of health.
Uh oh. Miss, miss, miss. Okay, at least we know this guy stayed back. <clears throat> Come on, sniper. That was totally my mistake. <laughs> Move our sniper up. Bunker. Damn. Oh, geez. Wow. Excellent tactics, jerks. Okay. That was pretty impressive on the aliens part. Still, only my sniper's been wounded. Where's the other rookie? Can't get down there without dashing. Remember, we want that floater. Weird tendency to run forwards. Unfortunately, I don't have time to screw around. He's gonna be the last one. We're gonna know right where he is. Huh, man. Ah, oh, so many mutons. So now there's five.
We definitely don't want one of these beasties hanging around. <clears throat> With 13 hit points. It's probably a leader navigator. No. Are they... Are they all? Maybe they're... I don't know, these are like next generation craziness. Look, that guy's got eight. Okay, no, these are just regular mutants. Really need to heal somebody. See if we can lure anyone to attacking this rookie. Okay, where do we want all this healing to happen? Here is probably agreeable. This guy first. Three of us in the blast. Give us a second, that would be great. Uh, of course, Blood Call enhances all their statistics. I don't mind letting him hold up a couple people. This guy is ballsy. It is a little bull. Okay, so we can see three, four. There's one left unseen. Definitely can't afford. have these guys close in. We're gonna ship the sniper to the roof. Hopefully he doesn't trigger an overwatch that kills him now that I think about it. Okay. Move back or take him out? Definitely advanced further than he should have. to savior can actually heal all these hit points at one shot ok 
Okay. <clears throat> I'm gonna bank on none of them being close enough. Of course, we're moving our assault or running gun first. Most flexible movement. Okay. Now our shotgun equipped rifleman. We should be up to finishing the job with Executioner. We protected ourselves from grenades, got our overwatch on. A little overwatch here. This guy, just keep him busy. Twice you've evaded my rookiness. Totally evade all my snipers, you jerks. Okay, we're gonna pull back. I think that guy's got overwatch. Yep. They both? Damn. Well, we just lucked out. Thank you. I'm blaming it on the skeleton suit. Finally some overwatch. Shotgun? Shotgun overwatch? No, oh, he's not coming through the door. They're trying to pull back. I hope so. What? Well It's not a bad stun opportunity, just saying. Okay, looks fairly safe. Well, you know, it happens.
Hmm. That is bad news bears for him. Hilariously, if I can lure him in using a grenade, my rookie may survive. The wounded. Let's see if we can frighten him with Overwatch. Tempt him with grenades. and prepare ourselves to do a capture maybe? I don't know. Nah, let's not get too fancy. We're already asking for it. Great, that's the best thing I could have asked for. Alright, the sniper is just not cutting it. You see why snapshot is so good. We can probably get two capture opportunities on this guy if we're lucky. Not lucky enough. Maybe we can capture this guy if we don't kill him outright. Alright, here's the plan. Capture this jerk. How, you may ask? Making every other idea a bad one. If he grenades these two, like I've said, not so bad. Reloaded. I really don't expect him to move forwards, really. See what this guy does. It's not falling back. Ah, uh, well. Everything by the numbers. Oh yeah, I lost a shiv. I was like, who died? It's okay, shivs are cheap. You can't buy experience. Six day wound on our sniper. Perfect. All right, nice. Shame we couldn't get that floater, but that worked out. All right, thank you so much for watching. That's been a long one, and I will see you next time.